Chinana, the ethanol project. In the shadow of the global energy crisis, particularly after the sharp rise in fuel prices, along with adverse climate change and deteriorating environment indicators, the world began actively searching for substitutes which meet increasing demand for energy whilst being environment friendly. As a consequence, ethanol began to attract attention as a potential natural alternative clean energy source which meets these requirements. Potential was soon spotted in the sugar manufacture industry where ethanol could be produced from the green byproducts of the manufacture process. Recent advances made in the sugar industry have made it possible to produce ethanol on a wide scale sufficient to ensure economical feasibility and competitiveness. Kinana Sugar Company a pioneer sugar producer situated in Sudan, a country of vast natural resources, was the company to take the initiative and the lead in making this dream come true. Recognizing the potential, Kinana Sugar Company started studying and planning its ethanol project with an initial production capacity of 65 million liters. The capacity was planned to increase incrementally to reach 200 million liters of ethanol to cover various fuel needs and uses. The project has been designed and implemented with state-of-the-art technological standards in consultation with Dedeni, a pioneer in ethanol production equipment. Once the plan was approved, there was the need to select a suitable location, which KSC ensured will be a prime location in the Al Safaya area right next to the sugar factory. This ensured that the molasses produced during the process of sugar production were directly utilized in the production of ethanol. The cost for the ethanol project was estimated at 35 million US dollars, most of which was self-funded by KSC using its own resources. The gap was covered by the Bank of Khartoum, with which a financing agreement was signed in 2007. The agreement with Dedeni was followed by import and shipment of the equipment from the port of Santos across sea and ocean on a long journey reflecting the determination and resolve of all those involved to create the first project of its kind in Sudan and the region. The arrival of the precious cargo at Port Sudan was at three stages corresponding to the stages of implementation. Each batch was then delivered directly to the project site to be handled by experts who supervised assembly, installation and civil engineering aspects. TechServe was selected for that task after having secured the acceptance of their bid in a tender that was globally rolled out. Kinana Sugar Company has also set up task forces comprising the talent and experience needed to tackle the execution stage. The most advanced logistic and communication resources were employed to connect the task forces together, ensuring swift decision making and business continuity in the face of emergencies and events that could have hindered the project. These efforts resulted in the completion of the project in a record time compared to similar endeavors globally. On the other hand, awareness raising and advocacy highlighting the importance of the project constituted an integral axis for the company which was crucial to the success of the project. Addressing that axis, the company organized a big workshop in 2007 focusing on raising awareness about ethanol fuel as a renewable source of energy that is not harmful to the environment. Among the attendees of the workshop 
were globally renowned experts who reiterated and stressed the need to support this industry as well as endorse and facilitate its various uses. In 2008, the Council of Ministers held a meeting at Kenana. One of the meeting's key decisions was one directing the addition of ethanol to automobile fuel at the starting rate of 5%, which was to gradually increase over time. Moreover, the project was granted tax waivers and special concessions for its early stages. Yet, the most important stage following the launch of the project was the marketing of the product, which Kenana carefully planned and prepared for. This was met with great attention and support from the government. Citizens have also embraced the project well aware of its nationwide importance environmentally as well as economically, cutting back on fuel costs and creating new jobs. All these factors made the Sudanese market well prepared to accept the arrival of the Sudanese ethanol. Furthermore, Kenana's adherence to international standards from the very beginning ensured the international markets would be open for this product. The ethanol project is a shining page in the history of Sudan and of Kinana Sugar Company, the innovator, owner and leader in the execution of the project. It represents a dream come true for development, progress and pioneering action in a field which promotes environmental protection and economic prosperity. Above all, it represents a sincere, faithful endeavor to achieve the noble objective of community development and service to the nation. Kinana, renewable green source of food and energy.